Alrighty folks, so American Standard has fathered the dead center of it, saw that for the first time today. Happy New Year, it's January 1st, 2017, and um, just a ton of gems for father already today. American Standard has father at the dead center and is perfectly offset from father. Wow, and uh, chocolate fountain at the buffet restaurant is flawless for father and that I did not know that they only do that on New Year's Day and Christmas Day both numbers of which are plus one for father uh, the first day the 25th day and they also do it on Mother's Day I think but um, I just gotta make this video American Standard wow that is like on the top of sinks toilets urinals faucets all over this universe for the glory of God the Father in the sovereignty of the blessed it's exactly the way it's supposed to be with Father of the Dead Center. And it just leapt out at me like a truck. It's so mind-blowing when this hits you for the first time in world history. It just like, whoo, takes your breath away. It's a Holy Spirit moment. But um, I was in the bathroom at the Fit for Less in Langley. And I've always known that American Standard is plus one for Father, just like Sloan and Regal. Those companies are on the top of all the, the, the metal for urinals, bathrooms, all that stuff. And, um, but as I stared at it, I knew that ST, stand plus D equals 58 father, but as I stared at it more closely and went right into the center of American standard, that equals 58 equals father, the name above all names for all time, there will never be a name higher than F-A-T-H-E-R, father, as Jesus declared to us from start to finish and the whole history books do that mathematically. So this is very exciting that these discoveries continue to happen. And as I said last night when I recorded a video, I said there's going to be a ton of these revelations in this great year, 2017, which is plus one. Today's the first day of the first month. Uh, awesome for Father. And I was at the Buffet restaurant here in Langley. It's called the Buffet. Buffet ends in Father. And lo and behold, as I walked in, never seen it there before. And all the dozens, like all the times I've been there, hundreds of times, uh, chocolate fondue machine. Okay, chocolate is Father. Fountain is Father. Uh, fruit equals Jesus, but letter for letter points to Christ more accurately. And it's really cool. They have skewers, a skewer through the fruit. And then you dip it underneath the fountain of chocolate, okay, skewer is 81, 3 times 3 times 3 times 3. I liken that to the Holy Ghost, the third member of the Trinity. And then fruit is glaring for Christ, and then chocolate is glaring for Father. So you got a Trinity uh, combo there. Uh, so i got a lot to preach on. This is probably going to be a very long video. I'm just going to let the river flow. We're going to talk about whatever we feel like talking about. Um, but God leads me. It's all about satisfaction for his children. And I went to the buffet, topped up, had the best meal ever. Um, but I couldn't stop eating. Strawberry with chocolate is my favorite. Strawberry parallels Christ. Chocolate is perfect for Father. So you get those strawberries, put chocolate on top. Remember, Father's on top. He saves the best for last. Chocolate goes on top. It's all ordained for the Trinity. Um, but you, you can solve it all. And so we were, as I was eating there, I got notes on my iPhone. Remember, phone equals father. Uh, he owns it all. And then uh, the I in front just adds three times three. So iPhone maintains offset from father. My iPhone is connected with TELUS, which equals Christ. It's a Christ father combo. God's just been revealing all this stuff to me as I just keep going everywhere. Okay. Uh, but to me, that was very exciting. I mean, when it hits you for the first time, so this is going to be a long video, unedited, uncut, raw, just like I always do, maximum truth and uh, maximum honesty. And uh, so i got to try and find a whiteboard pen that has not run out of ink because I've used this board so much and burned through so many pens. I mean, it's going to take me a little while. But we're going to try and have fun with this. And uh, first of all, i got to see if I can find... Uh, a whiteboard pen in here. Um, it still has ink in it. Remember, the word ink is perfect for Father. Uh, pen is perfect for Christ. The ink is greater than the pen. Ink is Father. He gets the last word on all the signings of every law in world history. Sign is Father and all this good stuff. Um, so, Windex. The only cleaner I've ever needed. Windex is perfect for father. Glass equals father. Cleaner equals father. Windex. The original glass cleaner. So, we're going to get some Windex. 
Clear off some white space on this board and preach some eternal truth never before seen by mankind. Okay, I'll be right back. Don't go away. Um, <laughs> so here it is, folks. Windex, the original cleaner. Uh, perfect for father and glass cleaner, both equal father. All right. So... Previously, just by way of review, we solved caramel chocolate. Caramel is minus 24 from Christ. Chocolate is plus 24 from Father. Chocolate equals the Lord. Equals my first last name, Derek Cutie, 82. I love it. Um, caramel chocolate, divine combo. I've loved it my whole life, but it's a perfect Christ-Father combo, so that it equals Christ plus Father. Caramel is minus 24 from Christ. Chocolate is plus 24 from Father. It's paradise on earth in your mouth. Um, now you know why we have so many people trying to get a piece of this combination. Uh, from caramel milk, every chocolate bar to the sun basically is doing this. Uh, taste buds, same deal. Taste is minus 12 from Christ. Buds is uh, minus 12 from Father. And all this parallels. And we're solving wine brands here and, and all this cool stuff. Okay, but it's time for new glory. So, Windex, the only cleaner I've ever needed. Okay, here we go. So, this is going to be fun and worthy of our eyeballs. American Standard. I cannot resist getting this on the board. Now, first I partook of a chocolate fondue fountain, which we're going to solve. I talked about it already. Uh, chocolate Father, Fruit, Christ, Skewer, Holy Ghost. Um, but uh, American Standard, because this one just hit me. I want a good pen. I told you I've burned through so many of these. I have no idea. American Standard. I'm going to have to look this up again on Wikipedia, but from what I know, they're like the biggest toilet appliance company in the world, practically. I mean, everywhere I go, in every bathroom, it's like American Standard, American Standard. Well, today, for the first time I saw it, jump out at me. This is what I was thinking in my mind. I know that stand equals love. I know that stand equals father. Okay, 58. Stand, love, 54. Stand. And then as I just shifted my eyes a little bit, oh no, look, look at this, oh my, there's a stand right there, equals love. And then I was just, I was feeling the Holy Ghost, I was like, we're getting right to the center, we just need four points more, there's your four points right there, and now you have 58 equals Father, the name above all names, at the dead center of the great company American Standard. As in, like, every toilet, and every sink, and every faucet, and pipe in the history of the universe. I'm just like, shh. Okay, so here it is, folks. Pay attention, kids. This is glory. Okay. So there he is, Father at the dead center of American Standard, the great company. Like, you'll never go to the bathroom the same way ever again. Okay. Now, um, and Father is at the dead center of the Lord as in the most repeated pronoun in the entire Bible. And a whole bunch of words which we've ripped through in the computer, Father, the dead center of everything, and it's just awesome. But this is the first time, and I, for the record, I saw this live, in color, in real 3D. Wow! I was in the bathroom at Fit for Less Gym here in Langley, British Columbia, Canada. And I, was always, I always knew American Standard was plus one, but I never uh, got this gem. I stared at, stared at it and uh, it just jumped out at me that Father's at the dead center of American standard. <laughs> so you're just like, okay. Um, lovely. Uh, so what, just, yeah. So stand equals love plus 458 Father. 33, like, nice chain linking of threes here. Yeah, there's, so again, there's your love. And it just keeps getting cooler and cooler now as I look at this. Like, there's so much love sitting in American Standard. God was leading me to find love in everything from the very beginning. But S-T-A-N is a very famous love. It's the beginning of the word Santa and all this. But, so there's a stand right there. There's a stand right there. And there's a stand right there. There's, like, love screaming out in the center of this word. But this is so awesome because love, now count the number of letters on the left. So here's your center binding these words together. There's love at the dead center of American Standard, 54. Now count the letters over here. One, two, three, four, five. Six to the C. And then one, two, three, four, five, six. And you're just like, oh yeah, perfection achieved. God is sovereign, and it's exactly the way he wants it to be. Everybody say exactly. Everybody say perfect. 
Everybody say flawless. Everybody say God will not be argued with. And don't mess with the truth. Because it's perfect, it's flawless, and no one will change it forever and ever and ever. Amen. Okay, so, American Standard. American has eight letters. Standard has eight letters. Put eight and eight together, you get 16. In the center of those 16 letters, you have love, followed by Father. And it's all for the glory of God the Father, the name above all names, who has love at the center of him, and it's all about love, and it's all very Father. Okay. So, <clears throat> that felt good to get that one out. And then the more you look, the more you see. Like, you can, you can find other gems in there and dig around. And then you start to memorize these words. Like, I knew, um, I, like I, I knew American is 64. I had it memorized. And, uh, in fact, that provides plus one for Father. And, uh, oh my! Woo! And then I just found Father in American. Wow! For anyone, in my opinion, that lives in the New World, including... North America, Central America, and South America, we are all American. <laughs> the new world, the great new world, the best coast is the West Coast, as I say. West and best, uh, both parallel father, the name of all names. And the word coast equals father. Um, but, and I currently stand at Langley, which is in the West Coast, B.C. Okay. But, it just jumped out and you find father in American. It's a perfect trifork. You just need to pop off... Uh, uh, oh no, you need to pop off six points, pardon me, an A and an E, okay, fine, um, but standard is 81, okay, so American standard adds to uh, 145, okay, which is father plus truth, okay, truth, father, but the coolest thing of all is that father is at the dead center of American standard, and in fact love is at the dead center of that. Wow. And this is a very famous set of letters for love. S-T-A-M. Very cool. <laughs> Big love in humble places, isn't there? Okay. Um, man, that's awesome. Cool. I'm just looking at what else I see here. Like, lots of beautiful chain linking of threes in this. Like, threes, threes. Put the A-M and the D together. Grab the R on that quad team. A, A and D, three. You know, threes there, these five by three, so. Um, there you go, for the first American Standard, first time I saw that. Um, and it was in the Fit for Less, which, I, which is a fun one that I saw before. Fit for Less, because it uses digits. Less is plus one. The four digits together with the T to make 24 multiple of three. Fit for Less, I've solved. The name of the gym is perfect for father, and the parent company is Good Life, which is plus one for father. That's the gym that I've been going to. Okay, but. Let's go back now to um, the gems that I had. So there you go, American Standard. I encourage you to look them up on Wikipedia. Find out how big and how old the company is, who the founder is, solve what you want, but just appreciate uh, this brand. It belongs to God the Father and Jesus Christ the Son and the Holy Ghost. And uh, worship them for it, thank them for it, and marvel at how big this is and how sovereign God is over it all. Okay, got that? Okay, more gems. Let's. Let's keep going through my day, which I can journal. Let's go. All right. So I got some notes here, but I'm going to um, I'll, I'll get to those in a second. Let's. Uh, so <laughs> chocolate fountain. So I was at the buffet. The name of the restaurant is called the buffet. God gives me many buffets in life. Buffet ends in father. Right there, he gets the last word. And then when you pluralize buffets, that puts Father at the dead center, 58, okay? And that's the actual name of the restaurant, is The Buffet. Letter for letter, that's the name of the restaurant, The Buffet. <laughs> it's like, you know, if you're really just trying to summarize something in the universe, you just say, The Buffet. <laughs> like, that's a cool name for a restaurant that's a buffet. It's like, we have defined The Buffet. And so Father gets the last word. He's on the end of uh, buffet. Okay, 58. Buffets, okay. Um, and then buffet equals holy and all the 60. You can solve more. We're talking about Father gems. Okay. So, um, at said buffet was a chocolate fondue machine. And... Uh, <laughs> My reaction when I saw it, I, I was blown away. I'd never seen it there. 
and uh, I saw it. I asked uh, one of the servers that I know very well. I said, when did you get chocolate fondue? When did you get a chocolate fondue machine? And she says, we only bring it out for New Year's Day, Christmas Day, and Mother's Day. And maybe one other thing. Now, they should bring it up for Father's Day because it declares the name Father, name of all names. Um, but I noted that those days are plus one for Father. Today is New Year's Day, January 1st, 2017. Every number is plus one, one, one in 2017. And uh, by way of review, plus one, you divide the number by three. If the remainder is one, that is plus one. Um, and uh, so I was just thrilled at that, and uh, <laughs> later on as there was another lady uh, standing next to me as I was approaching the machine, I just, well, 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 <laughs> whenever I'm going to partake of something that I know is from God, it's just pure delight and I love the reactions of my own soul, it's very fun to, to, uh, to experience. But well, well, well is a great triple, the word well, of course, is perfect for Father, it equals uh, 52, 52, 52. Well, well, well. And Father is the well of life from which we get all of our satisfaction. Um, and so it's just a great set of letters. Well, well, well. Well, well, well. <laughs> what have we here? Well, a chocolate fountain ordained by God the Father for our pleasure and satisfaction. Well, well, well. It's just, I think I will drink of this well. And in fact, it's even called a fountain, which is like water from a well. You know, like, so water is father, chocolate is father, and like flawlessly for father. Like the three plus twos, the one plus one, and the rest of the letters divided by three. Water, well, father, chocolate, fountain. I'm just like, I will partake of this creation. Well, well, well. What have we here? We have a gift from God that is perfect and satisfying. And I love studying details. It's very pleasurable. God speaks to you. He says, count everything. As later on, I was like, there are exactly four tears on this chocolate fountain. Four is flawlessly plus one for Father. Three plus one, Father's on top. Okay, so we saw chocolate a million times before, but this is so cool because chocolate fondue, by definition, puts the chocolate on top of whatever it is. Like anything goes, of whatever it is that you want to cover with chocolate. And I was like scouring the rest of the buffet. Now they had fruit, different fruits around the fountain, chocolate fondue fountain, and marshmallows and rice crispy squares. Um, but I ended up scouring the buffet saying, what else can chocolate go on top of? Um, and everything tastes better with chocolate, pretty much. Um, but, uh, okay. So, why is that the case? Because Father is on top, and Father saves the best for last. Okay, uh, Chocolate declares the name Father, Father goes on top, uh, fruit points to Christ, and then detail skewer, the word skewer um, is 81, 3 times 3 times 3. I, uh, mark, <coughs> I put that to the Holy Ghost. Okay. Skewer equals love plus half a love. The Holy Ghost equals triple love. I think it's a great combo. Okay, so first things first. Let's get a few words. Uh, chocolate fountain, chocolate fondue. I told you this is going to be a long video. I, um, I filled myself to the full with food. Now I can preach for a long time. And it'll probably take me a while to get my satisfaction in this preaching. And so this is probably going to be a long video, uncut, unedited, and so be it. <laughs> okay, so kids, here is how the word chocolate points to fathers. Very simple. Letters that do not divide by three in both words are A-T-H-E. Right there. And the rest of the letters all divide by three. Very easy, very glaring, very obvious. Chocolate equals 82, it's Father plus 24. Offsets of threes, to the glory of the Trinity, okay? Father equals 58, chocolate is 24 points higher, and then you look at the individual letters to get more glory out of it. Um, chocolate equals 82, equals the Lord, and is a personal gem that equals my first and last name, Derek Cutie, which, fine, that's just the way God ordained it. Um, and then, 
Fountain, same deal. Now, Fountain is, is equally perfect. You have three plus twos, a single plus one, and the rest of the letters divide by three, just like in chocolate and in father. Fountain equals 100. I did the math while I was sitting at the buffet. And so Fountain is plus 42 from father. Offsets of sixes are king. I, I love even numbers in particular. Uh, so chocolate is plus 24 from father. Fountain is plus 42, same digits as chocolate fountain. And said chocolate fountain had four tiers on it, which is plus one for father as well. And uh, now I just, details, okay, details, details, details. Uh, they had pineapple there, which is plus one for father. Strawberry is Christ. Uh, truth be told, I like both pineapple and strawberry greatly with chocolate fondue, but on today, I uh, enjoyed strawberry the most. Okay, so I'm going to just give you, give you a lowdown here. So skewer equals 81, 3 to the power of 4. Strawberry is perfect for Jesus and Christ. Okay. And chocolate is on top. Chocolate goes to Father. Okay. Father is on top. He's the top member of the three-person God. God the Father, Jesus Christ, His Son, and the Holy Ghost. He's on top. He is the official highest of the high. There is no one higher and no name higher than Father. Okay? He's the high. Okay? So chocolate is, and he says the best for last. The word best and last both declare Father mathematically plus one. Okay? So chocolate goes on top. You're just like, this was all gained by heaven. And I kid you not, folks, I was just scouring. I was just chowing down. Because I had the word of the Lord, and I was just like, and I was actually desiring it. I was just like, I chow down on chocolate fruit with whipped cream. Now, whipped cream is also flawless for Father. They had whipped cream there, too, and that goes on top. So I was just chowing down on the chocolate fondue machine with the fruit and the whipped cream, and just, mm, for like the first big chunk of my meal, and then I branched out into the rest of the entire buffet, just completely milked everything to the uttermost satisfaction. And it was absolutely fine. Um, but, so, chocolate, father's on top. Uh, it's very easy to do this, check these offsets in your head. Strawberry, 57. Oh, there's your 81 at the front, plus 31, 1, 1, plus 36, 147. Oh, yeah, strawberry is 149, offset of Christ. And then skewer divides by three, the Holy Ghost. But father's on top with the chocolate. Just like whipped cream is plus one. Um, so offset from Christ, strawberry is, wow, plus 72. That is a huge, hugely perfect offset, okay? And then chocolate is plus 24 from Father. And then like I said, skewer equals love plus half a love is pure threes, three times three times three times three. I liken that to the Holy Ghost. The Holy Ghost equals triple love. Love, 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 skewer equals love plus half a love. Holy Ghost is the third person of the Trinity. Strawberry is Christ plus 72. And as you study these letters more, you can find, you know, more glory in there. And, but chocolate is like, bam! Father gets the chocolate. Father gets the chocolate. And I just, all these revelations and just marvelings. As I was eating strawberries, I noted that strawberries have their seeds on the outside of the berry in like perfect spacing all around the berry. And there are not many fruits or foods that have the seeds on the outside where you can see them. And I'm like, there's something special about strawberries. Uh, the word seeds, which we've had before, is perfect for father. It's father minus six. It's the plural, just like trees, just like leaves, okay? Um, but I couldn't get enough of those strawberries. I cleaned them out and they had to bring more out and I had more strawberries, and it was just chocolate fondue madness. Okay, so, um, but chocolate is plus 24, and strawberry, so chocolate, you can write an equation. Chocolate is father plus 24. Strawberry is Christ plus 72, okay? Literally a triple of the 24. It's very obvious. It's a heavenly ordained combination, which when you put it in your mouth, you sing your head off and float to the moon. That's exactly the way it works, okay? Um, now, you can do father, father doubles. Pineapple is very father, king of fruits, many people call it. Historically, it has that nostalgia about it, royalty. 
Um, just like fountain is a father word. So chocolate fountain is a father, father double. If you have many chocolate fountains at a huge party, which we will have, then you have a father, father, father triple because the S on the end to pluralize it is plus one for father. So chocolate fountains is a father, father, father triple. Okay? But here is an example of a father Christ combo, just like the first couple on planet Earth, Adam plus Eve. Okay? Adam plus one for father, Eve plus two for Christ. Okay, divine marriage, okay, um, chocolate, strawberry, so father's on top, and then I put whipped cream on top, which is also uh, plus one for father. Okay, um, I am almost CH, I'm looking at, I just, for fun, I, I'm, I'm wanting to find a little bit more, squeeze a little bit more of the word strawberry, so I see the RS key that exists in Christ. And what else do I want? And then the H and the I and the C is another 20 points. So you can easily find Christ for beta in strawberry. There's the R, S, T, and then take an R and B, and there's Christ exactly. And as you hunt around, as you spend more time looking at all these words and use computer algorithms to max out, to just squeeze, it's very easy, it'll get done eventually. We use computer algorithms to just literally just squeeze every last finding or every word that exists for Christ Jesus the Father and it'll all come to light and people will all be like goodness me God has been sovereign over every word in the entire universe in the history books it appears as though our education system is being reformed <laughs> for our satisfaction and salvation hallelujah okay so um so now if you want to put these three together, take a skewer, put strawberry on, then chocolate on top, and you get a giant, beautiful three fest. And it's all very happy and wonderfully magical. Um, 250, 230, plus uh, 82, I did it, 42, 413 or something. Like anyway, so you can do that for work. Okay, fine. Okay, very, very cool. Sovereignty of God. Chocolate fountain. Father's on top. Very cool. Very cool. And the word delicious is plus one for father. You can solve a whole bunch of words in uh, this realm. And um, it's all about satisfaction and God the Father's pride in perfectly satisfying you as his child. And the Lord has been giving me the word satisfaction like crazy. And Satisfaction has father on the end and at the dead center. Okay? The famous T-I-O-N equals father. So father gets the last word on so many words in the English language. Like education. Attention. You know, institution. Um, satisfaction. Um, there's a host of them. I used a computer to rip through them all, and you're just like, oh, father equals 58 really does get the last word. And it's it's very glaring, too, because the TN at the bookends of shun equals the dead center of father, 34, and the IO, which both divide by 3, equal the bookends of father in perfect symmetry, 24. So it's like the shing, shing, perfect, like, box. <laughs> father is your satisfaction. If there be satisfaction that you have ever experienced in life, it came from God the Father, okay? And so Father's at the end of the word satisfaction, and he's also at the dead center. And it's just a little review for me as to which letters that includes. It is obviously these. Right there. Let me just double check. I can already smell it. 18 plus 40, yes. So Father is at the end of satisfaction, and he's at the dead center of satisfaction. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. Thereby declaring that the Father is the name above all names, the goal above all goals, the person above all people, and that's it. He is satisfaction. Okay. Um, So there's Father at the center, and there's just flanked in threes, 21, 24, 33. There's a love right there, you know, plus 24. So 
Okay, so I certainly got my satisfaction at the buffet. Okay, um, maybe I'll hop over to the notes that I, uh, man, <laughs> chocolate fondue. And then if you want, the word fondue, you can solve every word. The word fondue is perfect for Christ. Okay, so chocolate fondue is a father Christ combo. The word machine is flawless also for Christ, in that the number of plus twos exceeds plus ones by exactly one in number, yes. The word machine, in fact, is Christ minus 24. Very kingly offset, multiples of six. Are you getting this, okay? What? Oh my, it just came to me. Chocolate machine, therefore, equals Father plus Christ perfectly. Hallelujah! This is the identical to the example I had on the board before I erased it at the beginning of this video. And uh, so, so watch this. I walked into the buffet. I turned my head. And there was a chocolate fondue machine that I have never seen in this restaurant before. And I cried out to the lady. I said, when did this happen? She's like, it only happens on New Year's Day and Christmas Day. Plus one for Father and Mother's Day. And I was just like... This is ordained by heaven. Thank you, God, and we solved it all, and here we are talking about it. Okay, so, machine is, is perfect for Christ. So, machine is 53. Christ equals 77. So, machine is minus 24 from Christ. But let me give you the details on this word machine. Here's the plus twos. Remember the definition of a plus two. Okay, You divide the number of the letter by three. If the remainder is two, that's a plus two. For, for speed, I say plus two. Okay, very simple. So all the plus twos just start with the letter B, going up in threes. B, E, H, and up you go. K, and all the plus ones are A, D, G, and up you go. And then the letters that divide by three are C, F, and up you go. Okay, and that's how Christ and the Father are pointed to by everything named in history books. And everyone can do the math, which is why this is so awesome. And it's a giant treasure hunt. Like, this is real. Like, I'm going into bathrooms and I'm solving gems. I'm like, toilets that God ordained. I'm like, this comes, this was here, this has a brand on it, ordained by heaven to take care of our needs for our satisfaction. And you're just like, okay, go kids. Go. Okay, so machine. There's your three plus twos. Here's your two plus ones. The number of plus twos exceeds plus ones by exactly one in number. The rest letters divides by three. That matches Christ perfectly. Okay, here's the plus twos in Christ in H and a T, here's the one plus one, the rest of the letters divide by three. Now that you see that, you can zero in. And look at the similarity between machine and Christ. Oh my, oh my. You know, you have, <laughs> um, okay, a lot of similar letters, a C and H and an I sitting right there. T is parallel from sixes from that one, and then the all were all offsets and sixes and now the same thing with fondue. Fondue is actually like perfect for Christ because it's six letters. Here's your two plus twos, your one plus one, and then three letters that divide by three, just like in Christ. Okay, you can literally say a beautiful one, two, three in Christ. One plus one, two plus twos, and three letters that divide by three. It's very clean and it's very satisfying to say. Christ, one plus one, two plus twos, three that divide by three. Bam, bam, bam. And now here we are looking at fondue. You can have cheese fondue. You can have chocolate fondue. You can have strawberry fondue. You can have whatever fondue you want, but it's pointing to Christ mathematically while the entire Trinity is glorified in the whole package very efficiently, very tightly, and very perfectly. So, it's all maximum, it's all tight, it's all fast, it's all furious, and it's all very clean. Okay, so. Farnu is in the house. What does it come to? Reveal yourself, Farnu. You've been hiding out for too long. Okay, so Farnu is definitely in the house. What does it add to? Well, I see, oh my, I see love. I can't believe this, folks. I see love at the dead center of Farnu, and it's at the dead center of Christ. Do I just go home right now and leave this camera running so we can all calm down for half an hour? This is insane. Okay. All right. So, 
Love is at the dead center of Christ, and love is at the dead center of fondue. <laughs> I can't believe this. Um, this is the first time I've ever seen this, ladies and gentlemen. No wonder I'm so happy. Okay, so, <laughs> love is at the dead center of Christ, just like American Standard, the toilet company, and love is at the dead center of fondue. Already then, this is good. Okay, like the NV equals 18, and this OU equals 36, double 18. Put triple 18 together and you get 54 equals love. It's all very magical. It's a very famous set too. O-U-R, O-U-18, our Father who art in heaven, the first word of the Lord's Prayer, our equals love, and it's all very magical. Okay, ordained. And then Christ is half love plus half love, like the dead center is half love flanked by half love. So it's very odd. So you have this beautiful balance between them, like, unbelievable. <laughs> you have half a love, half a love in Christ at the center. Half love, half love. Fondue, you have a third of love, two thirds of love. Bang, 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 bang. Sherlock, Christ, invented fondue together with the Father. And he said, it's going to be called fondue. I tell you, it's going to be called fondue. Don't you dare spell fondue wrong, or else you're missing the whole glory. Glory equals Christ, equals power. Don't spell fondue wrong. You need this accurate. Okay, so, so that was satisfying. Love is at the center of fondue in Christ. And then, so Christ adds 23 to that to bring 77. This adds 11. Oh my goodness, it's an offset of sixes. Oh my goodness, call the police, call the fire department, call your mother, call the Queen of England, call someone. This is a revelation. Okay. So, fondue equals 65 is minus 12 from Christ, a glorious offset of sixes. Like I've been saying from the beginning, in all my videos, by the thousands, these are out there waiting for children of all ages to scoop them up and sing their heads off. Okay, so, um, where did my pen go? Alright. So, now, for the record, chocolate was father plus 24. Let's, so, so this is how, I, I just want to hit this home to you. So chocolate, all right, so fondue is flawlessly Christ, okay, Christ minus 12. Machine was flawlessly Christ, Christ minus 24. And so, I walk into the buffet, just doing the math on the word restaurant, restaurant is Christ, so, anyways, you can solve more. So I walk in the restaurant. I turn my head, and lo and behold, there is a chocolate fondue machine staring me in the face like I've never seen it at this restaurant. I scream to the worker. I say, when did this happen? When did this come here? She's like, it only comes here for New Year's Day and Christmas Day. I'm like, those are both plus one days for the father, and here we are. Okay. Um, so, and boy, I was, <laughs> and then later on as I uh, approached the machine and there was a, a lady standing next to it. I, I was just so excited to, to dig in on this one. I said, well, well, well. <laughs> because I couldn't wait to just, I was like, this is pure delight here. Okay. And you think about it afterwards, like, well, well, well. Of course, the word well is perfect for father. Well, well, well. Okay. So, chocolate plus 24, fondue minus 12. So, also a chocolate machine is going to equal Father plus Christ perfectly. Okay, Chocolate is plus 24 from Father. Machine is minus 24 from Christ. Bang. A chocolate machine of any sort equals Father plus Christ perfectly, um, which is love plus love plus half love. Okay, When you put Father and Christ together, it makes beautiful threes to glorify their triune love nature with the whole trinity. Okay, So, a chocolate machine. That's, uh, you know, basically every single piece of chocolate I've ever partaken of in my life came through some kind of machine to help produce it. From the harvesting, to the manufacturing, to the packaging, the wrapping, the chocolate machine. Father Christ, okay. And then chocolate fondue, same glory, chocolate fondue. This is Christ minus 12, chocolate. Okay, that was really fun. And if love was at the center of uh, all that. I cut on both. Um, wow. 34. Amazing. Okay. 
and you can find like love and chocolate and like all this. Okay. So that did not disappoint. Okay. Fondue machine, chocolate fondue. And then fountain was equally beautiful for father to chocolate fountain. Alrighty then. Fun stuff. It's so cool. Plate equals love, skewer equals love plus half a love. But father is on top, the chocolate. Father's on top. Plus one. So cool. Oh yeah. Okay, and let's just back up the truck now. To the actual item. Okay. Just quickly. So fruit. Fruit equals Jesus is, is, um, is Christ minus three, and then chocolate is Father. And so as I ate fruit with chocolate on top, that's exactly what it is. You put chocolate on top of the fruit, and it's all good. And then you can push this higher. It is, in fact, liquid chocolate. Okay. So we solve chocolate for Father, and then liquid keeps the pattern going, because you have one plus two, one plus two, one plus one, the rest of the letters divide by three. So that maintains perfect offset. So with liquid chocolate, you can keep adding more and keep solving more. Okay. So that was really fun. <laughs> Alrighty then. So I'm going to grab my iPhone here. Remember, phone equals father. And I just, I made a few notes. Um, but uh, it's, it's all about satisfaction, folks, and the Holy Spirit leads you through feelings and um, just speaks to you in the moments while, while you're doing all this. And He'll lead you every day for the rest of your life, and uh, He will give you satisfaction. I believe that God is rebuilding the temple, the body, my body, which actually belongs to Him. And uh, so I'm eating a lot. <laughs> to rebuild this body, which belongs to him. I feel like my entire back is like rebuilding itself, because I've been doing a lot of back work through stocking, Costco wholesale, and, and weight training and all that. So, God is, you know, I, I just, I need to eat a lot. <laughs> I need to eat a lot in order to get my satisfaction. So. There it is. Well, the restaurant is called a buffet. <laughs> there you go. Well, huge gems. We solved American Standard, all the world's chocolate fondue machines, which is very awesome. Wow. And then it's really cool. Like in English, we refer to cocoa, you know. Very, very famous. All these, it's very simple. All these divide by three. These are like three. 15, like king threes, and then your single plus one, which is a one on the end. So it's obvious that Father gets the word Coco. Like, this is the same design as so many words, like the word Lord, where just the last letter is plus one ends. Okay, the word Lord, Coco. So Father is declared by Coco, Lord, and you can just rip through all of them as I've done on computers. Okay. Um, okay. So, maybe I'll just get to some of the notes on my phone. The word notes is perfect for father. Um, in fact, that's the name of this program that I use to write these notes. It's just called notes. <laughs> notes equals number is flawless for father. Three plus two is one plus one. That's letters divided by three. Just like the word number. It's very simple. Um, okay. I told you this was going to be a long video. And I've had fun words from the Lord. Fatten up. Fatten up. Like, you got to get some fat on your body. Fatten up is flawless for father. Pig out is flawless for father. This is going to make you laugh. Sometimes God tells you to pig out. Like, you have to feed your body to the maximum. Maximum is plus one for father. You have to. Like, just feast, my child. Pig out to the glory of God the Father who owns your body and is uh, building your temple. It belongs to him, but uh, he's building it. You might need some repairs and you need building blocks. You need food. <laughs> I mean, one of my favorite words of all time 
is parallel to father. There's your, there's your, all your letters divided by three, and your single plus one on the end. Food, Lord, you're just like feed me. Okay, so, <laughs> alrighty then. By the way, God willing, we're going to start Father Brand Clothing and Father Brand Company, where every item and piece of merchandise that we produce is branded with Father. And uh, black hat equals Father. Okay, so imagine Father written on this to the glory of the name of all names. Uh, black equals hat equals father. I'm wearing a black hat here, which can be part of father brand clothing. Write father on the top in all capital letters. You have the name of all names. It will never be beaten. Okay? It will never. There is no name higher than father, and there never will be. So you've just captured, it's just, the buck stops here. Like, that's, that's the best company name that will ever exist. Father. Like, that's it. Like, there are many people trying to start companies with all these new names and internet websites. I'm like, father brand clothing. Father Brand Company. That's the name of all names. There will never be none higher. So let's just jump to the, <laughs> the kisser and just do it. Kiss equals father. But black equals hat. Black hat equals father. Okay. And uh, for the record, this is a flex hit fit hat, which jumped out at me like a truck. Because flex fit Farrell's father. In fact, father is on the bookends of flex fit. Okay. Uh, the first three letters and the last three letters add to equal father perfectly, and the X at the dead center is your bonus 24. So flex fit equals chocolate, <laughs> and father's on top. So I put this hat on the top of my head, black hat equals father, write father on the top of it, distribute these by the millions to children all over the universe, and it'll just be a giant father glorification fest. Name above all names. will never be beaten. Sorry, Nike. Sorry, Adidas. Sorry, every other brand out there, you have been diminished by the name above all names. Father. <laughs> okay. Now, God has been sovereign over world history and he's hidden his name and all these other... Anyways, one thing at a time. Father brand clothing. Father brand company. Um, we were going to... Uh... Oh! This is a fun one. <laughs> so God might tell you to pig out. Well, I certainly did today, and it was all that I needed. Okay, so check this out. Six letters, just like in Father. Bookends, make a multiple of six, 36. Inset letters, make a multiple of six, 30. Center two letters are the famous word, go. Plain and simple. Go, just like the word, do. Tiny little gems that point to Father, plus ones, gorgeous. Okay, and the word, stop. Go, stop, are also perfect for father plus ones, okay? Um, and, then, and so this is uh, offset of six from the TH at the center, minus six, okay? So multiples of six, multiple six, minus six, multiple six, six perfectly, perfect. So pig out, God the Father, you tell you, say pig out. You gotta feed yourself. And feed yourself, well, <laughs> okay. Um, well, well, well. That's like my favorite new suggestion. Well, well, well. Plus twos exceed plus ones by two exactly. The rest of the letters pure sixes. Uh, so for the record, pig out equals the grade 88. Um, father plus 30. Okay. Equals Walmart and lost our famous 88s. Okay. Um, incidentally, the designer of the Nike logo, uh, Carolyn Davidson, Carolyn and Davidson both equal 88. And that's for the glory of God the Father. It's plain and simple. Okay, so what other words can I just get out here? Um, so chocolate fountain, also known as a chocolate fall. Fall is a very gorgeous, simple, plus one for Father. Okay, so a chocolate fall and a waterfall. Our Father, Father, double. I would now like to solve every single vitamin in the entire universe for the glory of God the Father. And I've done this before, but I'll do it again. Vitamin C equals the Father. That is, in fact, the king of all vitamins. It's the most, if you're on a private island and you can choose one vitamin for your survival, you're going to choose vitamin C. Um, and ascorbic acid equals truth equals balm of Gilead. But um, vitamin. Look at, look at vitamin, just like we just did. Okay. Bookends, multiple of three. In fact, multiple of six, 36. Inset letters, 18, triple six. Inset letters again, multiple of three, 33. And then the A at the dead center provides your plus one offset, just like the TH at the dead center of father. Okay. So father owns the word vitamin. He owns it. It belongs to him. Everyone out there, all these companies, medical people, 
business people, everyone just trying to throw the word vitamin at you. Say, it. vitamin this, vitamin that. Who owns the word vitamin? Father does. While the Trinity is perfectly, maximally glorified in all these offsets of threes. Okay. Um, and vitamin, in fact, equals the great 88, as I just said. Father plus third. Um, but it's, it's the details that... Uh, and then so vitamin C equals the father perfectly 91. Add 33, which equals the... Okay. So I just want to set the record straight on who created and owns every single vitamin that has ever come into your body, which actually belongs to God. I want to preach on the importance of the physical body. Your body does not belong to you anymore as a Christian. Your body never belongs to you. It belongs to God. That's, he lives inside your house, the body. And so when you do your best to take care of the physical body, it is an act of love. It's not selfish. It's an act of generous love towards God who lives inside of you. So never be ashamed to take as much time as you need to pamper your physical body because it belongs to God. And so it's an act of love to take care of your body, to feed it, exercise it, pamper it, massage it, touch it. <laughs> if you have someone else in your life, they got to kiss it all over.